It is Saturday morning and I am just about ready to head up the street grabbing a air conditioner for Caleb in the caravan. We are expecting our first 30 degree day today and 32 degrees tomorrow. Got the AC sorted out to buying a second hand unit. I'm gonna head up the road right now and, uh, and grab it. Okay, so that was a very quick and easy pickup. Now just before I do head home, I was able to also get a couple of scooters. So now on my way home, I get to pick up two new scooters. So Sebi and I will be able to scoot around and have some fun on the scooters with Elliot. We've got the two scooters, both Razor scooters. Look, look what I got for you. Mom, Daddy, my scooter's okay. Yeah, what do you think, Seb? Do you like it? Mine. It's yours. Yeah. What do you say? Thank you, Dad. <laughs> You're welcome. Hey, guess what? I got another surprise. Look, I got one too. Oh, <laughs> now we all have one. Now all three of us have a scooter. That's my scooter you're riding. Costs zero money, I got it for absolutely free monies. Mum cannot say that I didn't get a good deal. Don't we love a bargain? And yeah? Daddy bought two surprise for you, your student Sabi. Yeah, did you know how much we got it for? For free! When I was four years old, yeah. we used to have a blue scooter. You had a blue scooter, it was like a two-wheeler at the back. So it was really good for little kids. Sabi was practicing his um, scooter driving. We now have to set up Caleb's air conditioner. I know you're really looking forward to this. I'm looking forward to it as well. It's going to be very handy. So, and degrees. It's already on. It's just not cold. Yeah, it'll take a, take a few minutes to cool down. Oh, okay, yeah. And it would work pretty well up in there. If I cut it down, I can connect on. Yeah, that, that works well. Just cut that back and in there, run it up directly to it. So, that's probably what we'll do. Connect it up. Feels good. Had a little bit of an accident while I was helping Caleb out just a little bit. So that's Caleb's AC set up. It's just running now. So I'm just gonna leave it for a few minutes and then I'm gonna go back out and check up and see how, how it's going. It was already really cooling really well when I left, but I wanna see how it goes after like 10 minutes. It should be really good. Just gonna clean up this cut and uh, then also I've gotta sort out his flyaway screen door because it's come away at the bottom and keeps getting bugs in. You can't have the door open, so we'll sort that out as well. It hasn't been very long, but it's already clear that it's going to make a huge difference in here. It's already making a difference. All I need to do is put some batteries in the remote. This is feels, this is super cool. Like it's really nice and cool. You have to have a vent for a refrigerated air conditioner to outside because it creates hot air. So we've got we've just used the old uh, range with there. Caleb doesn't use this oven, so it's good to go. Mom said we are not sure we are having milkshake. You want a you want a milkshake? That's what you did. Mummy say you could have one. But Mum said not sure. Well, I'll go and speak to Mummy and see what she meant. All right. I want to tell her too. So we're gonna have some chocolate quick. Dad. <laughs> so try it out. Tell me what you think. Tastes good. Tastes good. Tastes like coffee. Coffee. <laughs> Holy, that's. Super mega sweet. Super mega sweet. <laughs> so the groceries have arrived for the week. So I'm just getting them in now. You can help. Yes, you can, Sammy. Probably trying to do too much in one go. No, I think the milk one was just too heavy. Yeah. Yeah. Good job, Seb. Well done. 
Good job. Let's get this all unpacked and ready, and then we're gonna do a haul. I'm gonna go through them with you. The value is around uh, $420 from Coles. Start over the back here with five times three liters of full cream milk, fabric conditioner, two different scents, antiperspirant, some rinse aid, shampoo and conditioner, and a boneless leg roast, some frozen cauliflower and broccoli, some sliced smoked salmon, ricotta. Now we have got a lot of baby food for Violet this week, just sort of stocking up her drawer. So we've got all this organic food for six month plus age bracket. We've got banana custard, apple and pear porridge, chicken, sweet corn brown rice, beef with pumpkin carrot, and parsnip, lamb with peas, broccoli with a hint of mint, and several other flavors here. So there's 20 of these. So Violet is having some of our food as well, and we're introducing her to all different kinds of food that we eat. She can have this, and then she can also sample and have little parts, bits and pieces of what we're having. So we think it works really well. Over here we've got some fruity puffs. We've got strawberry and banana. Couple of packs of biodegradable fragrance free baby wipes. Got some chili powder. So that'll be for making chili. It's one of our favorites and looking forward to making that again. Got some tomato salsa. Two kilos of the long grain white rice. Got some two minute noodles, five packs. We got beef and chicken flavor. And we have some mints. We've got regular pork mints by two and also some regular beef mints. We've got some chicken mints, two packets of that as well and also chicken fillets. Got some organic snacks here. Kittylicious smoothie melts, strawberry and banana flavored, only organic iron enriched carrot and apple rice cake. So this is all for, for Violet. Two bags of original bagels, 800 grams of formula, Nan being our preferred brand. A bunch of these uh, baby mum mum snacks. So these ones are the rice rusks. There's also the apple and pumpkin, berry and carrot. Some cereal here for Violet as well, oats and wheat cereal. We've also got four packs of English muffins, two original and two spicy fruit. Got some oat milk here, particularly for Ebony. She was finding that cow's milk is upsetting her tummy, so we got her that. Two bottles of creamy soda, brown traditional creamy soda. Two dozen eggs, large free range. A kilo of pink lady apples. Packet of gourmet tomatoes. Two punnets of strawberries. We got some Greek natural yogurt, some Mission Mini Wraps, plant-based burgers here, uh, obviously for Ebony's benefit. Just two packets of that, two four packs. Some smoked salmon, lemon and dill dip. Some Mersey Valley pickled onion cheese. The Coles Tasty Cheddar. We might have mentioned this before, but it is worth mentioning that this is now $12.50 to buy, this one kilo pack of the Coles Tasty. Somewhere between six and 12 months ago, this was $8. It is now $12.50, illustrating just how much the price of your everyday groceries has gone up. This is not a fancy cheese. This is just a basic tasty cheese, Coles brand. Four pack of salami, mild Hungarian, some spreadable cream cheese, some natural pot set yogurt, two packs of Ritz crackers, a kilo of Devon, good for slicing up, putting on sandwiches, olive oil spread, two kilos of Australian charisma potatoes, red onions, a big party pack of Doritos, a half a cabbage, two pack of mini capsicums, two packs of cherry tomatoes, a bag of carrots, we have two avocados and four continental cucumbers, and another bag of brown onions. We also have some coleslaw, two mangoes, two bunches of bananas, another one kilo of apples, Granny Smith, two loaves of bread, one white high fiber, and one whole meal, two boxes of cornflakes, a tub of honey. Now it's upside down because Sebi was bringing it in for us and he dropped it and cracked the bottom. So we're going to figure that out. And there you have it guys. That's what we got for groceries for the week. As I said, $420. Well everyone, that will conclude today's vlog. Saturday is done. One more day of the weekend left to go. Not sure we're gonna get up to tomorrow. It's gonna be another warm day. So I'm really looking forward to that. So we'll probably be spending time out in the man cave, like we are right now, and outside as well. Had a good time today. I'm very happy to get those scooters, as you can probably tell. Please feel free to comment, like, and subscribe to our channel. Until tomorrow, who remains?